year, disasters force millions of people to flee their homes. It is crucial to prepare for these events and to provide effective assistance to the people affected. But only long-term development planning can prevent natural events from becoming costly disasters. Displacement after a disaster is not inevitable. Building homes in safe areas, investing in resilient infrastructure and addressing other environmental, social and economic factors can reduce the number of people displaced by acts of nature. People can remain displaced for months or even years after a disaster strikes. Around the world, destruction, repeat events, appended livelihoods and a lack of money leave millions internally displaced and in need of long-term solutions. When people flee from disasters, they usually stay close to home. And the vast majority of people stay within their own country, making national and local policies critical. Preparing for small-scale events can make a big difference. Extreme events get more attention, but small-scale events are more frequent and widespread with significant impacts for these people and their communities. In a changing climate, we cannot wait to address displacement. While climate change is only one factor contributing to displacement, it is making weather-related hazards more intense, communities more vulnerable, and the need to address the underlying causes of displacement more urgent. By understanding the social, economic and environmental dynamics, and by factoring disaster displacement into long-term development strategies, policymakers can help prevent natural events from becoming major displacement disasters. <laughs>